Hey guys, Johnny here from TechMajesty.com. Today I'll be showing you how to unlock your Xfinity Mobile Samsung Galaxy A10e step by step using an unlock code. Now I'm going to show you this on the Samsung A10e, but this method will work on the Samsung A50, Samsung A70, and all other Xfinity Samsung phones as well. We can unlock your phone regardless of any outstanding balances, financing, contracts, blacklist status, etc. The unlock will not affect your warranty, it will increase the resale value of your phone, and you'll be able to use the phone with any GSM carrier of your choice. All you need in order to unlock the phone is an unlock code and a non-allowed SIM card which is basically a SIM card that's not from your original carrier. So let's begin. The first thing we will need is the 15 digit IMEA number which you can go and get by dialing star pound zero six pound. This will give us the 15 digit IMEA. So now that we have the IMEA number of the phone we will go on the computer and open the internet browser to go to techmajesty.com. Once we are on this website, we will place an order to unlock our Samsung phone. We will go to the Samsung unlock code section. Then we will choose the Samsung A10e since that's the phone we're unlocking today. After that, you will go ahead and choose the carrier your phone is locked to. After you choose your carrier, then you will enter the 15 digit IMEA number that we got in the beginning of the video. Then you will click on the add to cart button and go through the checkout process to complete your order. Once you complete the checkout, you will receive an email within the stated time frame with your phone's unlock code. The email will look like this and say order enclosed. The email will contain the unique unlock code for your phone and it will include full instructions on how to complete the unlock. So now that we have the unlock code, let's move on to entering it into the phone. In order for the unlock prompt to come up, we will insert a non-allowed SIM card into the phone. So let me go ahead and remove the SIM card tray. and I will be inserting a T-Mobile SIM card. So as soon as I insert this SIM card tray back into the phone, the phone will ask for the network unlock code. And there you go. So this is where we will enter the unlock code that we received from techmajesty.com. All right, so now that I've entered it, I'll click on the unlock button. And there you go, network unlock successful. So that means this phone is now permanently factory unlocked. And as you can see, T-Mobile is listed at the top left hand corner of the screen. So guys, it's as easy as that to unlock your phone and to start using it with any GSM carrier of your choice in the US or internationally. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and don't forget to subscribe if the video helped you. Thank you so much for watching.